What's going on, everybody? So, got the second PSA order in the week. Still got number three. Should either be in today or tomorrow. That's only five cards you guys will get to see because I just tagged in somebody else's order. Uh, overall, very good. No eights. Uh, I want to say it's about 70% gem rate, so you guys get to see those. I've actually done this video probably a handful of times, if not on my second hand right now, from either sneezing from allergies or being interrupted by the terror little baby pug. So, hopefully I get to make it through this. If not, I'm probably just going to do a whole lot of cutting and splicing because my allergies are really kicking my butt today here in the state of Kentucky. Alright, let's move on with everything here. If you guys see it in a PSA sleeve, it means I'm holding on to it. If it's not, it's going DC Sports. So, up first, 95 Pacific Crown Royal Barry Sanders Pro Bowl die cut. Came back a 9. There were no 10s out there. And uh, Pop, I believe, on these were way oh, somewhere around like 7, 8, maybe 9. I don't think it was over 10. Very, very hard. Very surprised. I was thinking it was an 8. Um, really happy it came back a 9. I know everybody's going to ask for pricing on this. I have no idea. I'm probably just going to put it on a table at 150 and see what comes around to it. Because some Barry Sanders collector out there may want that. 2013 Topps Chrome Geno Smith. You'll see a few Genos in this. This one came back at 10 as well. A lot of these cards that I go through, I'll talk about some of them, are like $30. I think high is like $80. Minus probably the Barry and maybe one other card once I get to it. But I looked at it this way when I did this. Is I, I want to make sure I also say this too. I looked probably close to 80,000 cards to get like 100 cards to go to grading. Total. Um... If you're out there and you're, you know, just starting grading, don't plan on getting a bunch of 10s. It takes a lot of practice, and no way am I saying I'm really good at it. Sometimes it's just the luck of the grader you get and the luck of the card, and things go your way onto it. But with this, a lot of these might only be worth like 30 to, like I said, I think 80 was the high, minus the Barry Sanders. But I paid $19 to grade them. We'll just throw $2 per card for shipping there and back with insurance. So I'm in it for $21. Uh, when I did the math up on these and I lost the sticker somewhere out here. Let me see if this is it behind here. Okay, this is it. So roughly value-wise was $1,260. Uh, 543 would have been spent for grading, shipping there and back. Which would have left me with six hundred and se or I'm sorry, seven hundred and seventeen dollars remaining. And for some reason, I took twenty five dollars off. That might have been the shipping back. I take it back. That might have been the shipping back. Was the twenty five? So total profit that if I do max out on all my sales would be six hundred ninety two dollars minus any kind of commissions, taxes, I'll have to pay into the year. It's just a lot of work. A lot of work onto it. So I, I forgot to put that into this. Okay, you guys seen Gino for a while. Let's get move on here. Gino Smith, rookie die cut, tops chrome, PSA 10. Pretty cool card. First one going on DC. Nine, tops magic. What's that remind you of? Gypsy Queen. Rookie enhancement. Came back a nine. Womp, 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 womp. Nah, we're going to have nines. I knew it. Um, This is just regular Panini. It's not a blue or nothing like that. Just a building blocks. Gino Smith, rookie card, PSA 10. Prism, Geno Smith, PSA 10, rookie. Now we go to Devontae Adams. Lots of Devontae Adams went in this order. Facing forward, Pulsar, we graded one of these about a year, year and a half ago. Got a 10. I remember selling it for like 90. I know they dipped a little bit in price, so I'm guessing it's around 60 maybe now. But uh, PSA 10. Three. 2014 Topps Chrome Devontae Adams. This is the 85 throwbacks. Everyone came back at 10. There was probably like 20 to 30 of these that I went through. Um, Just lucked out with the ones I selected, I guess. When you get to see multiple cards of the same exact player and card, I guess you could say, you can determine which ones are the best to mail in. And if you get 10s on, then you start thinking, can I slot anything else in? I usually don't, though. <laughs> I run with, with the good part. Uh, 14 Topps Chrome, Facing Forward Refractor, PSA 10, Devontae Adams, rookie. Just a regular Topps Chrome, Facing Forward, Devontae Adams, rookie. 
Tops Chrome Mini, the 53 or 63 Minis, PSA 10 as well, too. Pretty cool. There were a bunch of these. Um, if I move this, I might send more in, but this is the Mini from 2015 Tops Chrome Peyton Manning white jersey. They're around $40 to $43 a pop. Uh, decent profit. Like, you know, if you send 10 in and all 10, 10, you know, say you're in them for $21 a card, you sell them for 42, it's 21, you know, take off probably, uh, whatever, uh, fees you have on to it. You know, you could make $18 a card, $180. It's not bad. If you start doing stuff like that. All right. Jamal Williams. This is silver prism. They were all silvers this year, I believe. Yeah. 17 was all silvers. Came back at 10. I could not find anything on this because hardly any of them were graded. I'm thinking a lot of people tossed these in the trash back then. So, a lot, a lot of stuff there. Only one so far for DC Sports until now. We're going to hit a stack. One, two more nines. Tops Chromes. Um, be lucky if I even break even on those. This I was hoping for a 10. Jimmy Garoppolo, Tops Chrome, rookie. This is the Orange Refractor PSA 9. I believe these were numbered. No. Still should get something decent out of it. Uh, Andrew Luck, PSA 9, light blue wave. These are numbered out 99. There's some Luck guys still out there. Somebody's probably still trying to build that set. Ah, uh, we got a 9 on this Juju. This is definitely a loss. Probably sells for about 12 to 15 bucks. But I was off on one. But he came back with two tens. When I sent these in, these were selling for about forty to forty-five dollars a pop. I think they're down to around thirty now. I could be wrong, but we'll hold them for start of the season. Hopefully, he does something. Maybe they pop back up. I don't know. If not, we'll still take a couple dollar profit each card. Couldn't find anything on this, but it's the Panini playoff. Both Brady and Gronk, Thunder and Lightning came back a nine. Pretty nice looking card though. There's Thunder, Lightning on the back. This is one of the ones that's around 70-ish. Uh, Optic, Dak Prescott, Rookie, PSA 10. This I have no idea on, but it's going to DC. Pulled out in a break. Traylon Burks autograph, Contenders. I can tell you when I looked at this, I don't know if I could see it on here. There's a little divot above his foot here. Was the only thing I could find onto it. Other than maybe... The centering left and right being a little bit off. But I think they're really looking at the frame area of this if you guys are grading. Um, we'll see because I think Joey sent a couple out. We'll take a look at those when they come back. Just to see if they're the same thing. Lindor, update Tops Chrome, PSA 10. Those were a lot higher. And just in time, Marquee Jimmy Butler, rookie PSA 10. You guys can see my finger back here. It's kind of like an acetate there. But perfect timing to get a Jimmy Butler rookie back. So overall, did pretty well. As you guys can see, there is a Barry Sanders in there that's a 9. But there's a not... Well, we'll just take this. We'll call that the Sanders. Overall, pretty much like a 2 for 1. Every two to every ten, uh, 9 I got, I got two tens. Could not complain whatsoever onto it. I appreciate everybody watching the videos. I will probably try to get some of these up on my slabs. Uh, probably this evening as you're watching this video. Because um, I will not be able to get it at the time of this recording. Because it's late at night for me already. And I got to be up early for work. All right, that, guys. Thank you very much for watching the video. Hopefully you enjoyed a little PSA today. Uh, be on the lookout for the next one. I believe we went 4 for 5 on 10s onto that one. Uh, some cool cards in that one too. All right, everybody, take care. Have a good one. I am out.